Hey, Pussy and Pussy Net, another video. Uh, this one uh, yesterday was uh, net for my amateur radio club, and uh, I tried a new antenna that I got. It's mostly for the outdoors, but uh, this time I tried it uh, in the urban to see uh, how it would work and stuff. So I took a few pictures and stuff, and I'll, I'll, I'll get through it. Um, it was very easy to set up. It's for uh, what they call SOTA, SOTA sorry, uh, which is Summit on the Air. And basically what it is is that it's uh, a way of communicating as, as hiking. It's big in the UK and in North America it's getting a little bit bigger I guess. Uh, but uh, in the UK it's pretty big so that's, that's what I got my, um, my antenna from. And so I'll show you the picture of uh, the antenna when it's fully assembled uh, from the website and then uh, we'll go to a few pictures so uh, let's start that so uh, the first picture is a, um, a picture of the uh, the antenna itself uh, so um, you see here so basically uh, it's four or two meters but uh, yesterday I tried it on the um, 70 centimeters and it worked great um, so basically how it's set up it's uh, PVC's and there's uh, dipoles in it and it's basically a vertical dipoles uh, also you can apparently listen to SSB on it uh, if you put it uh, horizontal instead of vertical and so um, so the way I was carrying it is um, as you can see here in the bags um, initially I, I had it uh, with the T kind of um, on the top but uh, I reversed it and uh, that's how I was carrying it mostly um, and I had to go get a piece at a store so I went through the um, the bus and the um, uh, transport uh, during a rush hour and I mean I never really had anyone kind of looking strangely at me or something like that uh, so it's pretty low profile and uh, the few times that I, I uh, try it, um, I literally kind of stop, uh, put it together, had a few uh, a trial for the um, the repeater that is around here, and uh, then unfold it, put it back in the bag, and it took uh, less than uh, two minutes to do that uh, procedure. So it was very effective, and every time, every place that I tried it, I, I was able to hit the repeater. Uh, so the setup that I was trying as well yesterday, uh, I tried uh, two different things. So there was the previous um, kind of stealth, if you want, um, antenna. Um, and at that time what I had was the anchor uh, plugged with the um, the, uh, the barrel fang on the, um, the um, uh, battery uh, extender uh, and uh, that's how I was carrying it in my pockets uh, so the cable was running uh, through my bag um, and I basically passed the uh, the cable for the radio through my um, uh, water uh, bladder uh, hole there and basically I, that's where I called the, the cable so it was very easy to manage and, and pretty uh, quick to, uh, to uh, control um, so uh, here's a little video of uh, what it looks like so basically my uh, my print uh, my physically what in the stealthy uh, mode um, and uh, over here now um, what you see is basically a picture of a selfie uh, through a window and uh, this is basically what I, I looks like uh, with the um, with the antenna in the bag uh, and again at that point I can still receive and transmit uh, as I try it uh, if I wanted to transmit better what I was doing is stop uh, put the bag bring the bag forward uh, put it on my lap um, extend the uh, the vertical uh, the other portion of the vertical and basically transmit on that uh, and the uh, uh, second part of my test is um, so after I did a contact so basically I got to a point then the net was about to start uh, so here you see this is the fully extended and actually I changed it a little bit from there and you'll see another video uh, soon how it looked like uh, so basically um, instead of carrying it inside the bag what I did is I carried it on the side of the bag 
and it kind of decreased a little bit the um, profile of it. Uh, and again, I was walking uh, in a village here downtown and uh, never really had any, um, any questions or people looking kind of strange or wondering what I was doing or anything like that. Uh, at that point, I uh, switched to a battery on the battle fan because uh, one of the issues with the, um, the um, um, anchor despite that it was working very well is that it was a lot of cable to manage and so uh, during that time I stopped at the restaurant uh, and again to show that you know it was very easy to portable and I did uh, like errands and have uh, I went for a dinner uh, before the net uh, I was able to carry but the problem is when I stopped and uh, I left the, uh, the my bag down the, the cable became a little bit of a mess so um, but uh, great antenna it worked great on the 70 centimeters um, this week I, I hope to be able to go uh, out uh, snowshoeing and have a night out and try that antenna and another antenna that uh, I've received so um, that was a short um, short video on um, my little experiments yesterday and I'll talk to you soon.